Hello everyone, this is Alec from AJ Farms, and today I'm going to show you what we've got growing on inside. Now right now it's the middle of winter, and for where we are, it's way too cold to grow any plants outside. It's supposed to be about 14 degrees tonight, so none of our plants would survive that kind of weather. So we have to move all of our other plants, or what we do intend to grow, inside. Now for Christmas we actually got a grow tent. It is 4x4x6, four by four by and it's got a nice mat at the bottom so it catches all the dirt, which makes cleanup very easy. And to support the plant growth, we have an actual grow light. It's a 4x4, four four, which means it's 4 feet long and 4 tubes. It's a T5 light bulb, so it's specifically meant for growing or a shop light, but it's got the right kind of... I'm not quite sure of the word, but it's got the right frequency? Luminosity? It's got the right wavelength for the plants to grow, very similar to sunlight, which is why it's so bright white. Now, in a minute, I will get in closer and show you exactly what we've got growing. Okay, so first we've got our Roma tomatoes right here. These were planted on... you can barely see that, but they were planted on Christmas. The Roma tomatoes, we've got about five of them in there, and they all sprouted. And as they get bigger, we plan on separating them into different containers so that they can get bigger and actually hopefully produce tomatoes. We're doing a little bit of an experiment to see if we can get them to go from seed to fruit inside. Over here we have our carrots. These were started... oops. Door's in the way. These were started about almost 70 days ago, so they're almost at full maturity. We have picked two, though they're very tiny. They are a little overcrowded in there because I didn't really thin them out. And if you look very closely, you may or may, not, may, or may not be able to see it. There is a little carrot poking through there, so that should be ready soon. I'm gonna try to let that one stay in as long as possible so it gets as big as possible. But you know your carrots are ready when they start poking through the ground and you can see the orange tops. But once we've moved them into the grow tent, the foliage has been doing really, really well. The old foliage, an example you can see down here, if I can get close enough, if it'll focus, is very spaced out and leggy, but once we got it into the grow tent with a better light, this one's much stronger than we had in the old grow box. The leaves were more compact and less spaced out, which is a sign that the carrots are doing much better in this one. And, as I said, they were planted almost 70 days ago, so they're almost at full maturity. These, I believe, are Danvers Halflongs, which are pretty nice to grow. It does take them a little while to germinate, though. Over here we have our sweet basil. That's... I'm not actually sure how long it's been in, but I have pruned it... I've pruned this particular plant right here twice. This one back here once. I've pruned this one once, and... That one's just starting to get better. I did have something weird going on where the leaves were all shriveled up, but that seems to have passed and- Oh, I just got a whiff of basil. It smells so good. But that seems to have passed and they're doing much better. I do plan on fertilizing these a little bit just to boost leaf production. And then right here, I can't really see those leaves too well, I've got three string bean plants. They are Blue Lake bush beans. I don't have room for pool beans in here. They'll get way too tall. But I have a few plants just because it was a small container. I did want to get something going because I really love these string beans. They're so good. Then over here, I've got cherry bell radish. They are almost two weeks old, though the biggest one right here is a little bit older. Though it's flopped over. I had it in a different area with a not great light, and that didn't go very well, as you can see. But the plants are doing much better now with this grow light. They are actually growing up. They're not as leggy, and they're just doing much better. And then these over here are my onions. I don't actually plan for these to bunch up, or uh, bulb up, I mean. I was just really growing them for the grass. We've been using it like green onions, and I've pruned it a few times. They've grown back and grown more. Though some of them are starting to bulb at the bottom, so if it does warm up enough and I can put them outside and I still have some left, I might actually transplant them outside and see if I can get any actual onion bulbs out of them. So that is what we have going on in our grow tent right now. Later in a few weeks or so, actually not very long now, we'll start our pepper seeds for 2018 because those take... you can start those anywhere between 8 to 10 weeks in, indoors. We'll also be starting our eggplants though, maybe a little bit later because they, they grow really fast. But yes, this is what we have going on now, and in a few weeks you'll be seeing what we will be starting for 2018. Thanks for watching!